Uh, my name is Philip Gilly. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Notes for Notes. So this is a huge year for us, and we couldn't be growing and providing these resources to youth all across the country without CMA Foundation. So the CMA Foundation's first support of Notes for Notes came in the form of a grant in the beginning of last year to help sustain our Nashville locations. We have two studios here in Nashville. Notes for Notes studios are fully equipped recording studios that do everything from provide youth the opportunity to explore, get their hands on music, drums, guitars, keyboards, turntables, a lot of contemporary instruments, free instruction across the board, and then obviously a recording studio as well, to not only be able to record their music, but learn about the other careers in the industry, create music, a product, and learn how to get it out there, and in turn get themselves out there too and learn about those other careers, but also the skill sets that go into making music successful, which can be applied to other areas of their life too, if they go on to other careers as well. So the organization started in Santa Barbara and moved to Nashville, and it was our move here that really allowed us to get the attention of CMA Foundation. And at that point, we only had five locations, and uh, well, at that point, yes, we had five locations, and now through CMA support, we're gonna to grow to another five locations just this year. So we're gonna be opening more with CMA support than we have opened that took us eight years to build. So CMA is helping us get to San Francisco, Detroit, Brooklyn, Atlanta, and we're narrowing in on whether it's gonna be Austin or Houston for the last one. Well, obviously having a room full of equipment like this is a phenomenal resource for youth that have never been able to get their hands on music. Um, so one of the first things is just exposure. I mean, a lot of the youth we serve and a lot of the parents of the youth we serve as well never knew their child was interested in music or oftentimes had a talent for it. I mean, we see so many youth, and especially in Nashville here, that walk into the studio saying, like, oh, I'd like to get behind the mic and, and see what that's like. And that's just a cool experience to be in the environment, which just kind of feeds the energy of wanting to explore further. So parents come in and be like, I had no idea my child could make music. And there's, there's a revelatory experience for not only the parent, but also the youth to be able to like show them something. Um, you know, it's not always about, you know, taking the homework home and if there's an A, that's a great experience, but also be able to take a CD home, like an original song, and that builds another kind of relationship, sometimes between a parent and child, their family member, other mentors, or other people in their lives of like showcasing a side of that young person that the child didn't know they had, but on the parent, but along the teachers. So really music can open up a lot of doors that everyone involved didn't even know could be open.